do you know? Only the outer worlds may know. Sorry, that was really, really, really stupid. <laughs> Anyways, yeah, we're back. Um, took some time off the game. Like, two hours. <clears throat> I just want to get back in, you know? Have another chill, relaxing game playthrough. Or... <coughs> Oh Lord, you know, I don't really talk much like I usually do. Maybe I'll talk like for the first five minutes and then, you know, for the next 30, you know, I just won't say a damn thing. But, you know, that's, that's just how shit goes here. You know? <laughs> Are you? Yeah, that's how we fucking do it. The fuck? Oh, wow. They're having a war. Come back and people are just gunning each other up. The fuck? My goodness, this game is beautiful, though. Oh, they got a mining thing up there. Am I the only one who, you know, thinks of those, like, balls? You know? Like, that look just like this, you know? You... Goes in and out. Or maybe I'm thinking of something different, but... There's balls that are, like, just like that. They look just like those plants. That's doing pretty good. I really want to get fixed is this bad boy. This was incredible. I'll tell you. How many weapon parts do we have? Parts. We only have one weapon part. Got big messes. Huge messes? Murder. Giant. Go on ahead. 
ahead, Captain. I'm not keen on ships, even when they're in the best of shape. Readying for standby mode upon command affirmation. Entering mode now. Can't give it to Graham. Graham's crazy. What's up? What's with the pleasantries? You want to know something? Just ask. All right. Sorry, I bothered you. Give them all. All the choices. Sorry. But them hippies, they gotta stop. Their time's come. Come to an end. Oh, the chairman, Mr. Clark. Minister Clark, not Mr. Clark. Cleric. Clark? That looks like a very North Korean poster. Or is that just me? Maybe Japanese. I don't want to do any of this. I don't want to have them fight, you know? At the same time, I kind of do. Does that make me a bad person? Kind of. I can live with it. I can live with it. With these hard choices. What was me?
If the Iconoclasts reach that ship first, there won't be any chance for a peaceful monarch. I don't suppose you've found the targeting module yet. I've sent patrols, but they're running into trouble with the Iconoclasts. They're all mad! And what's more, they left us! I don't see any way for us to work together. Ugh, not this again. Remember what we practiced, sir. Yes. <laughs> the words in those reviews were very hurtful, but they do not define me. I am a mantapillar, and my will is my cocoon. I can emerge and become whatever I wish. What a pussy. Normally, I'd find this kind of talk from you quite invigorating. But this is a difficult moment for me. Still, perhaps you have a point. Supposing you're right, of course who I do. exactly would you have me work with? The Iconoclasts are not the most compromising sorts. That's an interesting suggestion. I confess I don't know much about her except that she worked for Rizzo. There ain't a body on this planet that can keep a group patched up like she has. I don't know how she does it. I'd be willing to consider it, but I need to see her review first. Excellent. Her review would be in the Rizzo offices in Cascadia. Bring it to me, and I'll see if she's qualified. That's surprising. The board's equipment is usually in top shape. After all, they have oh, first yeah. access to any fresh parts or components. A conspiracy? You've spent too much time around Graham. Yeah, I'm not giving you it yet. We got it. We got to get this truce going. Come on, you two. Look at this run. Oh, you're so cute. Oh, Sam. You're my favorite. What does Cassandra want? We got this, Ari. We got this. We'll bring peace to both colonies. Kill Graham. Everybody's happy. Ooh, this is gonna be. Ooh. Lively people. Rizzo's.
to not promote Beyond Store Manager. Alright. Alright, let's head back. We got the data. Well, enemies are near. Fuck. Alright. <clears throat> We're, we got this. Coming up. Oh here, sounds like he's in trouble. Oh, it sounds like Sam actually might have it under control. Hey, motherfucker, leave my boy alone. Alright. Let's head back. I'm not about to fucking walk all that way. <laughs> Bluster dies. Look with the whimper. What? Monarch Stella Industries. War of the World's Fizzer. Fizzles. Fizzles? Bluster dies with a whimper. The fuck is a bluster? In the 21st century, the ship, the, the skip dot drive was. I can't even read! Look at you, you're so happy. Entering quiet mode. Hold it right there! It. What do you think you're doing? Um. I don't have time for this. Move along. I didn't see nothing. Hey. Any luck bringing the Iconoclast to the bargaining table? I don't like the idea that they'll be trying for that module while we delay. I have it. Don't worry about it. Very well. I can't promise anything, but let's see what we have here. Well, it seems like she... Uh, she's actually very qualified. If it weren't for her, I'd wager the Iconoclast would have died off a while ago. I wasn't expecting to say this, but if you can put her in charge and convince her to agree to a meeting, I'd be willing to discuss terms. Very well. All right. We are making great progress. Excellent. Buenos dias. Por favor. Por favor. Por favor. My Spanish is a little meh. The salvation of Emerald Val. Fail. Disaster forced to return. Captain, hey. we should chat. Graham's got the right idea, but he isn't the right guy to execute it. I don't even think he's motivated by philosophism anymore. I think he's just guilt-ridden. I can't believe I'm even saying this, but I keep going over and over it in my head, and the only way I see the Iconoclast surviving is we depose him. Yeah. Hell, most of our people listen to me already. Good, good. Take Stellar Bay. Lick our wounds. Eventually, figure out how the hell we're going to spread the word to the rest of the colony. Yeah. Sometimes, you gotta do what's best for someone, even if they think you're wrong. Even if it's painful. When we're in Stellar Bay, they'll come around. 
I'm going to confront him. Can I count on your support? E. Okay. Deep breaths. This is what's best, Sora. Time to save Monarch. The fuck, Sam? Captain, hey, you, you must be back with the access codes to our new ship. Graham, we need to talk. We have work to do. This isn't the time for one of our spats. What? Zora? You're running the Iconoclast into the ground, and I don't believe it'll get better after we take Stellar Bay. Yikes. The troops take Stupid orders fuck. from me already, and you've... You've brought me as far as you can down the eternal path. It's time to step down. The troops? Listen to you. This isn't an army. They aren't <coughs> soldiers. They're believers. Followers. They pick up a gun because you tell them to, not because they want to. And you, Captain, after all you've done for me, for us, you throw behind this mutinous blasphemer? How dare you. I can and shall. All I've done, I've done for my people. And look at where that path has led me. I've yeah. built this movement from the ground up. I've brought freedom to Monarch, and all these years later, we're still free. I joined because I believed that you were in it for the Iconoclasts. That you wanted nothing more than to bring freedom to Halcyon. Class. That you were selfless. But... I know the truth now, Grim. I know what happened in Amber Heights. You didn't start this movement because you wanted to save us. You wanted to save yourself. No. E. I've spent years atoning for my sins. I've studied, meditated, taught. I built the Iconoclasts so that any man could cast away his past for a fresh start. That's your answer, nah. Graham? You needed a fresh start? After all those innocent lives? I'm sorry. I believed in you once. I did. But it's over. Stand down. I won't. It's treason. What happened back then was a mistake, and the colony has moved on. This is my movement. These are my people. If you want to lead them, you'll have to kill me. Yeah, I... I had hoped. Please, don't make me do this, Graham. If this is Please, where my path ends, I accept it. But as long as I draw breath, I will not abandon them. So be it. The area has been sanitized. Your armor sucks, Graham. Oh, cheer well, up! Captain, here we are. Killed a lot of people in the name of the Iconoclasts, and it never feels right. The loincloths. But this time, it's... especially wrong. You've got the... Void held me. I'll never remember what that thing is called. The device from the ship. Do you have it? I've thought about it, but I think we're too far gone. Pulling Carlotta's support was crossing a line. You know, Captain, I never thought about that. Whew. Maybe he could be taught the, the thing eternal is my truth. Persuasion. Spread the message from within the corporations. All right. Don't yawn. If he's over there. willing to talk, I'll give him a chance. Thank God. Well then, I've got to prepare a few just-in-case measures. But when you're ready, let's meet at the old OSI church outside Stellar Bay. Here we go. Pride aside, this is for our people. Yeah.
just then. A bunch of ravengers come out. Slaughter everyone! It was a bloodbath! Ugh. I don't know. I mean, it probably happened. At least we avoid a war. See, now I would have hated to do all that for nothing. And hey, we got rid of Graham. Fuck Graham. Fucking Graham Cracker. Bullshit with his ginger bullshit hair. No. I hope hey. you know what you're doing. Move along. No. It's just me hey. talking to the. Thanks for coming. I yeah. wish I'd had more time to prepare a proper analysis on the costs and benefits of your proposed union, but uh, I suppose we'll have to improvise. I wasn't suggesting oh, you get married. The... Let's just get started, shall we? Sandra, <laughs> Stellar Bay's got food and walls, and my people need both. If you'll have us, we're willing to share the space. Do you have any idea what that would cost? Why, drawing up the budget alone is going to take weeks. <laughs> Though I admit I'd rather not. We've shed enough blood as it is. Is the only choice here between fighting and starving? No, we've got to be practical. Okay, hold on. So forceful. Hmm. You know I love your what little displays. Fuck? Perhaps I'm being hasty. After what all, the I'm fuck? rather good with numbers. <laughs> I'm certain we can find a way to make this work. Well, I'll be damned. If you two can work together, maybe there's some hope for this place after all. Thank the Eternal. As poetic as murdering him in his sleep would have been, I'm glad we don't have to. I'm confused. The look on your face does not match the words you just said. Come on. You can't be this obtuse. Tell me Graham wasn't working alone. He couldn't have. Void take his agreement. He stood by and let it happen. This feels like one of those times when everyone at headquarters but me is laughing at something. But you two aren't laughing. Amber Heights, you hallhead. Ten years ago, Graham had all those people killed. What? That's not possible. Even for him, that's going too far. But that means... I had no idea, I swear. Look, we were both fed up with corporate leadership, but I, I never guessed he'd do something like that. I buy it. Sanjar ain't capable of hurting a sprat, even from a distance. You can't take yeah. bureaucrats at their word. You back someone into a corner like this, and they'll say anything to get out of it. I... Okay, okay. You're right. Sorry. It'll take me a while to get over losing Graham. You know, I felt the same way years ago, when he first left. You know, there was something magnetic about him that let you ignore the things you didn't want to see. But surely you know what that's like. Yeah, I... I do. Okay. If you're willing to house and supply some of us, I'll have our more capable soldiers help out.
As am I. Oh, I can feel my blood pressure lowering already. Oh, that was intense. Thanks for coming out, Sanjar. I, uh, guess I'll see you at Stellar Bay. He's Gotta be archive. honest, Captain. Never thought I'd see the day. You've done a good thing for Monarch here. If you'll excuse me. Hey. Hey. <sighs> you gonna try to get out. <laughs> oh. Let's get out of here. Look at all these quests we don't got anymore. <laughs> Alright. Where's our ship? Why is there a... The fuck is out here? Hello, hello. You guys are doing great. Keep it up. Just gonna keep running. I don't have any active quest over here. What is going on? We have 11 left of those. You need to be careful. Incoming! Hello. What the fuck is going on at Fallbrooks? <clears throat> Will the depravity never cease?
MI, MSI joins forces with the loincloths. I know that's not what they're... I'm going to call them the loincloth. <laughs> and they're using their, pimp, their paper printing thing to make this. Oh, nice. It was because my ship's here. Said you docked three days ago. God damn, I walked all this way because my goddamn ship's here. Only thing the fuck? the swill they're selling is the service. Ticket. Thank you. I, I don't care, Sam. Oh. Alright, hold on. So I am scared of robots, but I have Sam as a companion. <laughs> Interesting, is that why I say ah every time I see him? Ooh. Hey, we brought peace to a colony. Or to a planet. I am amazing. A reminder to all crew members. The one toilet on the ship. Alright. Let's go. Destination reached. Scylla. Traveled enough with me. I feel like these two get along just good. I want to keep Sam with me. Sam's a badass robot. Why wouldn't I want Sam? Hmm? It's like it'd be stupid not to take Sam. He's probably one of the best companions I got. I mean, he's the last one I got, too. And you get all these side missions out of the way. Mm. It's so nice. How's my, um... Have another one? quickly looking at all my shit.
buy more health items. One, two, take out the trash. So, are we like a space bubble? We are. Hey, outlaw. Tremendous work, friend. Here I was readying a daring maneuver, and you've come and saved me the trouble. Symptoms detected. Elevated heart rate. Dilated pupils. Increased sweat production. Subject appears <laughs> to be terrified. I'm not terrified, you bucket of bolts. That's victory sweat. The one and only. Uh, wait, who's asking? Wanda didn't send you, did she? I wager she told you to say that, the sly old bird. I swear, land on Groundbreaker even a moment tardy, and that busybody's already been up your ass an hour. You tell her these Automechs are coming, and sending a hired stooge to rescue me from certain peril only furthers my delay. No offense. No. Yes, well, I shan't. Give Wanda my chilliest regards. You saved me the cost of ammunition. Thank you. What a little bitch. Back on the ship. I don't remember who Wanda is. It's been so long. I've done so many fucking quests. Quests that I thought would never, you know, get fucking done. <laughs> I'm sure I missed quite a lot too. But hey. There's if a lot on Moa. Stop in the engine room, would you ask Parvati to send Sam down to the bridge? Why? So my dad, he told me, would you let that boy push you around? So I hit him with Sometimes I wonder about Mr. Hawthorne. What was he like? Why'd he make the computer a talkie? You think he got lonely, flying about on his own? You want me to leave? Captain, you can't mean it. Are you fooling on me? This joke ain't funny. 
every SAM unit Felix keeps asking me to watch some adventure serial with him. It's not my thing, but he's real sweet about it. This shit feels like home. Destination reached. The groundbreaker. Distant Hunter. Second? What do you want? I can't believe I wanted to shake his hand. I need a shower. We're still on about this. Makes you wonder if being a treacherous, two-timing coward is some sort of contagious disease, or if he was just that way. I looked up to Clyde Harlow, too. Turns out he was just another fraud, like Graham. At first, I liked what Graham was doing. The iconoclasts were going to change Halcyon for the better. I don't think you were ever. But then we found out Graham was out behind the slaughter of Amber Heights. How can anybody so morally bankrupt lead a movement to transform the colony? I give up. Uh, boss, that wasn't a trick question. I was being, what's the word? Rhetorical. You'd never do something like that, would you? Slaughter a whole community of innocents? <laughs> sure, for the right price. For both our sakes, I'm gonna assume you're joking. Let's get back to it. I need to put all this ugly business with Graham behind me. Find our dehydrated water tablets. Just add air. Oh, it's Martin. Hey, Martin. Still wearing the hat? How observant. I'm authorized to state that this uniform is more than headgear. It's a state of mind, and our customers know the difference. Heard of it? My orientation aether wave showed that famous Saltuna. That's nice. I'm sure they're doing their best. That's the spacer's choice spirit. So, what can I get you? Some soap? Everything. I'm bound to satisfy headgear related inquiries. 
speak it's up, I can't hear you. It's not the best choice, it's Beezer's choice! <laughs> Chase the freedom! Oh, I'm having a stellar day. And not just because I'm legally obligated to say so. Almost as stellar as a Spacer's Choice is affordable. Don't get him started, Captain. He'll go on like this all day. All night, too. I can't escape these savings. Not even in my dreams. You would never ask if you knew what it's like in here. I mean... Why, anyone can be a Spacer's Choice Consumer Relations Choice Specialist. <laughs> Just keep your nose clean and aim for the moon. Uh, have a look. All right. Oh, he's got a lot of them. Yo, I can make all my people wear them. Hey, guys. Oh, you guys got perks to level up? Um... Yes. Well, well, Dr. Fenhill. It's not often I see you on this side of sick bay. I make it a point not to get shot, and when I do, I can usually take care of the mess myself. It'd be nice to have you in here patching people up, not just blowing them apart. I respect what you're doing here, but you know I'm not ready to settle down. It's not you, it's me. Have it your way, then. You always do. Burger King. Now, about your friend here. Were I a gambling woman, I'd wager you're responsible for my mechanical safe return. I can't thank you enough. I mean, you can. <laughs> I just can't. I can't. <laughs> 